for me. Hungry, terrified, clutching your babes to your breast. Emperor Emir has marched his legions into our lands, laid siege to every fortress from here to the Blue Mountains. Rabid and ravenous, he bites and bites away. Men of the North, you stand at the precipice. Your kings have failed you, so now you turn to the gods. And yet you do not plead. You do not kneel to dust your heads with ash. Instead, you wail, why have the gods forsaken us? We must look into the trials we failed long ago. In a time past, our world intertwined with another through an upheaval scholars call the conjunction of the spheres. The gods allowed unholy forces to slip into our domain. The offspring of that cataclysm was the nefarious force called magic. Yet we did not banish it, instead studying the vile arcane for our own power and wealth. And the monsters at our door, the unholy relics of this conjunction. The trolls, the corpse eaters, the werewolves. Did we raise our swords against them? Or have we laid this burden on others? On so-called witches. Stray children taught the ways of foul sorcery. Their bodies mutated through blasphemous ritual. Sent to fight monsters, though they could not distinguish good from evil. The flicker of humanity long extinguished within them. <laughs> yes, their numbers have dwindled through the years. But a few still roam our lands, offering their bloody work for coin. To this day, they shame us with their very existence. The North bleeds! Flogged by war! The battles are the gods' whip, chastisement for our sins. And let us not forget the terrors, the scourges from beyond our world. The wild hunt rides the sky with every full moon. The Dark Raiders abduct our children into lands unknown. Some say they herald a second conjunction. Can we chart a course back into the light? Will we find the strength to banish the mages from our kingdoms? Unite around the warmth of the eternal fire. Nigh is the time of the sword and axe. None will fight this war in our stead. Nigh! It's the time of madness and disdain. Well, that just paints a grim picture now, doesn't it? Also, I know the sound was a bit loud, well, but here's the thing. I'm not sure if that's cinematic volume, because if it's cinematic volume, that's a very cool shit music. Doesn't really fall under this category now, does it? Okay. Alright, we have great reduction now. Yay, which means. Oh god. <coughs> uh, base. Uh, I don't know what any of those do. <laughs> I don't know what any of those cards do. I haven't tried that mod yet. It's going to be interesting. I'll just leave them at base and hope that's good enough. But anyway. So welcome back to The Witcher 3. Wild Hunt. Blood and Wine. Hearts of Stone all that fun stuff. Because I decided... Even though it hasn't really been that long since we last did such, I decided I'm going to do it again. It'll be fun. So, we want to go here to New Game. So here's the thing, you can start for a start if you really want to. You can do Hearts of Stone, which... 
put you at what, like level 30-ish? Put you at like level 35-ish? Yeah, it amuses me because it's like, they made Hearts of Stone, which is like, ah, uh, here's a small area. It's like, level. It's like, fired. It's like, what? Eight hours at most? But then they made Blood and Wine, which is like training to 30 hours. Like, it's a proper expansion project. But anyway, we want new game plus. And here's the thing. Part of me wants to do harder difficulties. I think I will. Uh, simulate Witcher 2 save, yes. Because, yeah. Basically offers the choices to simulate what we did in Witcher 2. I think I turned that off last time and regretted it. Alright. Just continue. To start any game, you must first choose a save game made after completing a standard version of the game. Which would basically be any of our blood and wine saves. But since we recently did this, this should do. Hopefully. Oh, some more cinematics for flow volume. Cause I don't know what controls the cinematic volume. That guy's a Vulcan Crest later on. Be if it's the same guy. We're alive to see the person. Step off the battlefield. Flying there, so. Okay, can you place where that is compared to where we are now? Because I'm probably going to have a struggle finding it. Alright, we have to have this too. Which potions are deadly to ordinary folks? Oh, monitoring it. Isn't that lovely?
You know I don't find that amusing. It wasn't meant to amuse, but to prod you to hurry. It's midday already. You promised Siri you'd train with her. Go before Vesemir bores her to death with those etchings. So, later then. Hmm. See you later. You know, just take care of the sides. Yeah, of course, you have to have a scene change. Made sense. Can't just have them dress. Because clothes are hard, after all. Oh, uh, now we investigate this. You're running out of juice. I know. You might bring me some more once you're done training. Lilac and gooseberries, of course. Geralt, stop fingering my toiletries. Hmm. Can I go look at everything? Nothing but silver. Gold clashes with my complexion, you should know that. Got any clothes that aren't black or white? Hmm. Undergarments. See, I thought Siri could stand to wait a little longer. It's uninstructive. Not to mention unreasonable. I don't want to be reasonable. Aha, so that's the way the wind blows. Go and train with her. Then come back. It'll give me a chance to put my face on. Of all the women I've known, you're the only one who does that before. You've known many. <laughs> What's it matter? Only ever thought of you. Well, that's both sweet and wrong at the same time, Carol. Interpret best. Shit. Mountain Pass is beautiful as ever. I mean, look at it. It is pretty. Pretty. But now I'm you know, freaking out. The way it's, on. it's not like the wind very blowing. It's just that freaking out. It's bad. Well, we should probably head out. You know one thing that always bothers me though? During that intro video where the preacher guy's talking, it's like, Oh, witchers are blight on society. It's like, you realize that Regular people aren't gonna be that effective against those monsters, especially while war's going on. No, no, people don't Old think. Old Witcher's fast asleep. Ciri's disappeared somewhere, of course. Okay. 
guess she prefers practice to theory. Hmm? Why? Time to wake up, Master. These lessons so boring they put you to sleep too? Damn it. After taking notes on ghouls and owl ghouls, wanted to rest my eyes a bit. <laughs> Making her slog through that brick? No wonder she took off. John of Bruges lacks flair, true, but he's reliable. Not like the hogwash they print nowadays. She's tackling the pendulums, right? How many times do I have to tell her? Don't train alone, it only embeds your errors. Bring our young damsel to the lower courtyard. If she wants to practice, she'll get to practice. Gotta admit, we've spoiled her. We've spoiled her? I've been saying it from the start. Siri needs a firm hand. Been saying that true. But you let her walk all over you just like the rest of us do. <laughs> Fine. I suppose I'm partly to blame. But this has to end. Now. Killing monsters is not something to be taken lightly. Siri must understand that, if she's to become one of us. I'll see you below. Huzzah. Wrong. Now I see why you were so eager to practice. Strike! Circus pirouette. Wrong footwork. Enough, get down. With a flip? What do you think? All right, take off the blindfold. You've got work to do, your reflexes are still slow. Maybe for a witcher. Think drowners or striggers will go easy on you because you haven't undergone the mutations? No. Though in your shoes, I'd fear Vesemir more than any strigger. Disobeying his instructions? Unwise. Well, yes, but that book was horribly dull. I know. And you know that's no excuse. <sighs> I'm sorry. It won't happen again. Jeez, do you have ever... Drowners in Witcher 1 and how they required like hard attacks to even damage them otherwise they're like nope And they hit like a truck Like I went back and watched some of that it's like oh god <laughs> Compared to how they are in this oof Sorry's not good enough You're gonna read ghouls and al ghouls in its entirety appendices included No, please I'd rather clean the stables. End of discussion. Come on, we'll practice with the others down below. Shall we run the walls? Not this time. <laughs> Believe me, you tutorial. don't want to keep Vesemir waiting. It's new game plot. You don't need the tutorial. I like that. How is it like, Ashko? Anything to say though. for yourself, young lady? I'm very sorry, Uncle Vesemir. Young blood craves action, I understand that. But when you fight a beast, knowledge counts as much as your silver sword. At the very I'm least, you want to be able to tell want. a ghoul from an owl ghoul. Yeah, read all by the markings, like unto the Panthera Tigris that in Zeracania dwells, and by the sickly paleness of its visage. Hmm. So you did read the chapter. Still, you should have asked if... But you were asleep, Uncle Vesemir. Don't try to weasel your way out of this. A witcher must know how to trick his opponent. <laughs> you said so yourself. Might have. 
But don't use my words of wisdom on Vesemir, got it? That's playing with fire. Fine, we've talked enough. Geralt, you're with me, Lambert with Eskel, Ciri with a dummy. Again? Stop groaning and grab a sword. Yeah, because, you know, if you fought Vesemir, he'd check your ass. Set you on fire. What do you think? Right? Should we start by reviewing the fundamentals or go right to free training? Let's skip straight to free training. No point going over yeah, the see, basics again. Like, you don't need tutorials. Showed him. Yeah, it sounds like it got even quieter, doesn't it? Siri, get down here. Like, yeah, it got quieter because it went from it went to cinematic volume, which we don't have a slider for. As soon as she's back, we'll set her to polishing all the swords at Care Morhen. God, that's a way out. Find that helmet. Like, I'm not sure what'd be under Siri? music or buffets. Make sure to find every last blade for you. What that? Don't out the frost. By the way, loading. Bird. Can't keep my herd on though. Took the cake though, at least. Or did it? Question mark. You all right? <laughs> had a nightmare. About? It'd take forever to explain. We're gonna slide it anyway. Dawn, some way off. We've got time. Started in the guest room at Kaer Morin. I was relaxing in a tub and next to me... Triss? Yennefer. Funny, isn't it? She's never been there. Seems so real in my dream, though. Was she nagging you about something? <laughs> mm -hmm. True to life, indeed. We'll find her. We get some time until dawn. Suddenly it's dawn. I know we will. That's not what worries me. You've seen her tracks. She's at full gallop all the time. Breakneck speed through wild lands, devastated battlefields. She's in a hurry to get somewhere. Or fleeing something. Either way, it means trouble of some sort. Be surprised if she wasn't in trouble. She's always poked her nose in beehives. Courtly intrigues here, mages' conspiracies there. What do you expect? Don't know. Guess I thought once we were finally reunited, things would be calm. At least for a while. I love my eye. Calm? Patch. With Yennefer? <laughs> Good luck. The Metal Gear and all that. In the dream, I went and found Ciri. Then we trained. Those were the days. Hmm. Little she-devil. I've trained kids who were faster, stronger, but none had her character. Character's not gonna keep you alive. <laughs> Didn't end well, did it? Your dream. No. A wild hunt appeared, attacked Ciri. I couldn't move, stood there like a stump. It was just a dream. Sure it was. 
That's the problem. It was more. In the past, when Siri would appear in my dreams, something was wrong. She was in danger. We taught her how to defend herself from anything, wraiths included. Yeah, but they'll now exactly wraiths. They'll, you know, technically elves. Elves from another world. They have, you know, freaking well type of swords. Those are. It's like a, uh, I'm not sure. It's definitely elvish design of a sword, but yet it's like dark elvish design of a sword. <laughs> anyway. Be downing soon. Time to go. By the way. Wait. Show me the letter from Yennefer. Might have overlooked some hint in there. Didn't overlook anything. We were meant to meet in Willoughby. That's what she wrote. Meanwhile, one army or another burned the village to the ground. All we can do is follow her trail, so... Stop talking for a minute and give me the letter. Oh, how about that? It does smell of lilac and gooseberries. You were gonna read it, not sniff it. We must meet. Soon. Willoughby near Vizima. Hmm. Nothing else to guide us there. What's this postscript? I still have the unicorn? Stuffed unicorn. Used it once or twice. In certain situations. <laughs> the things young folk get up to these days. Back on topic. How's it look? How far behind Yennefer are we? Two or three days. Trail's fresh. But it looks like it leads towards the main road. Could be muddled there. By the way... Wait, hear that? I hear it. I smell it. Ghouls. To what level? 21. Remember, things are gonna be terrible. And Terry we so loud. Then the game's going to be one shot. Oh, yeah. Of course, when armies pass, necrophages follow. Let's go before any more show up. No, I need to leave these. Protect lots of stuff and never use it, really. Alright, now remember that thing? I mentioned this several times. There it is. Bird skull in black crystal. Why do I think this is Yen's? I don't remember how important part it is, but I should be able to pick that. I also should be able to follow his now. Just, you know. Trail's fresh. Oh god, no. It's already starred. Where do I start? Yeah, yeah, I gotta tell me what you found. Oh, by the way, I should make sure that the settings are still right. Because, you know, we are starting over, so. Okay, get on. Counters random. Do I have region constraints? Nope. Do I have spawns? Yep. So everything should be fine. Grit reduces base, I think. Which is fine. So I don't know why. So many corpses. And the war's just started. Okay. Flowers following a trail. What's that? Where my trail go? Okay. God, it's already started. It's like so, it said trail's fresh, and then I went this way, and it's like, nope, the trail's gone. What? <laughs> okay, well, fine, be that way again. This game, of course, wants us to follow Vesemir. 
think would be the smart thing to do. However, we have uh, prior knowledge. Prior knowledge says there's a lot of us. Four doors. I should probably check one more thing. Do I have it on? Okay. Up, oh, I have enemy ups going on. That's gonna get us murdered, by the way. That is gonna get us murdered. Ghoul nest. Ought to just destroy it. This enemy ups guy basically means you fight a bunch of rats that are gonna eat you to death. It also means we're going to counter. I forget. There's seven enemies that use magic. Magic, by the way, will one shot them. <laughs> it's doesn't scale properly at all. So it's just like, by the way, here's this flame light. And your trail's fresh. Oh god. And then you're dead. Guess I'm dealing with an old foglet hiding behind an illusion. Wait, what? A go foglet? Okay, well, I'll follow the trip. God, this random encounter what's gonna drive me insane. Is it that over there? God, that looks like a human. I'm sorry. What? Guess I'm dealing with an old foglet hiding behind an illusion. Oh, behind it. If it's hiding behind War is not exactly going our way. Either. We have a side. The Northern Realms. Radovid's realms, don't you mean? Tamaria and Edirn are no more. Yeah, Radovid's pledged to yeah. restore the old borders as soon as he wins the war. Believe that? <laughs> Gotta believe something. It's what keeps us going. Ever tell you about this sorcerer I knew? Couldn't stop talking about how useful they are as creatures. Because you can brew potions from their blood? <laughs> no, because by eating rotting corpses, they prevent epidemics. Hmm. Did he know they eat the living as well? No. Really upset him, too. His theory collapsed. Oh, by the way, what level am I? Oh, right, I am 70. Which means... We have two points. Yay. Two points means we can... Put points in top of blood. Which we ain't gonna use. Cause that would... I don't think I've ever done anything with alchemy. I mean, with the green. Cause there's a thing. They don't really use potions to combat. The oils could be useful. I mean, could be useful. Like, poison blades could be useful. I may put poison to that. Everything else, bombs, meh, whatever. Toxicity, meh, whatever. Hey there! I might get blade oil. So I'm probably gonna have to take a small break soon. We going? Oh, well, Help me! Help! My horse is still fabulous. And that's still Griffin. Must be a highly trained witcher.
Has it gone? Yeah. Come out. Gods, that was close. Nice bow. I was sure I'd end up like my mare. Provided you got lucky. Your horse died quickly, but griffins like to toy with their prey. Eat it, alive, piece by piece. Oh. You'd... you'd like a reward, I suppose. You don't owe us anything. You were in need. We helped. And they call witches heartless. Say they won't lift a finger without pay. They also say mice are born of rotting straw. Back to the trail? Like I said, leads to the main road and ends there, muddled. You seek someone? Yes, a woman. Medium height, long black hair. Seen anyone like that? No. But... There's an inn here in White Orchard. Sole one around. Gets its share of travelers. Perhaps you'll learn something there? Besides, the inn keeps my cousin. Tell her Bram sent you. She'll treat you like family. Not a bad idea. Especially since that wound needs cleaning. Ah, beast barely grazed me. But sure, could use a good rye. Nice and cool, you know, straight from a cellar. Let's go. By the way... Wolf. Greetings. Wow. Greetings. Yeah, Sad. So he wants us to go to the tavern. We'll get there. Okay. First things first. But there's my cape. Trails fresh. Damn it, Garrett. Garrett. There you go. Yeah, I don't know which way it's going after. It's going this way. Interesting. Oh, just interesting. Yeah, that, that very sums up why I'm hunting. Oh. Wait, is it going the other way? Game. Game Y. Why you do this to me? That's where the smart's going to drive me insane. Just because it's like this. Oh. Is it just like Oh, there's the second one. I was going to say, is it just you then? That lured me all the way over here? Oh well, grab it. But it how is it still alive? Where's the sorcerer? Trails fresh. Oh god. <laughs> oh, it's our way start. Trail fresh guys. Anyway. We're gonna save you. We'll be back. And we're back. Finally. When we're supposed to be riding to the tavern of Redman before we got distracted. Probably. Giddy up. But, you know, the trout's fresh. Get that trail is fresh. I have to frame drop because I left this going for like a few hours. I don't know, we're going by that little child over. I know is what I know. Right. So, oh. a griffin this close to the village? Strange. Well, I she went to the end. I thought exactly. In a forest.
I think there was supposed to be more to that conversation, but Fetchman was already here waiting for us, so we're just skipping to this. What? Take that down before there's trouble. That is a coat of arms, the Temerian lilies. They've a right to hang there. This ain't Temeria no more, old man. It's Nilfgaard now. My arse it is. I'll not drink with Weaver Lost Freaks. Beg your pardon for those thugs. No need. We're used to it. that. Folk are jumpy around here. Armies just pass through. Now a griffin's prowling about. <clears throat> Already had the pleasure. Ran into your kinsman, Bram. Bram? How is he? Alive. Sends his regards. Master Witches. Food and drink on the house. What can I get you? Well, let me just, you know, time to ask all the questions. Pretty busy place you got. Nation's on the move. Some search for kin. Others just want to get out of the way of the armies. They all need food, drink, and a night's rest in warmth. So, war's been good for your trade? Aye, so far. But it'd be best to know peace again. Times like these, you never know what tomorrow will bring. Yeah, like those just being burnt down and all that. Like... Like, this game really depends the whole situation. Of people are stupid. Cause like that whole take you down the shield. Yeah, that's a good idea to do that because <laughs> we paid Thronebreaker. We know what Nilfgaard's capable of. They'll burn down the whole town <laughs> if you piss them off. Like, this game doesn't even show how bad Nilfgaard really is in this one. Like, you remember Thronebreaker? Nilfgaard was burning towns down, murdering people, just for the slightest offense. Just because Meave kept getting in the way, they got pissed off and started, like, torturing people just because of that. So yeah, and the problem though is we know what's going to happen later on with all of this. And we're getting to that when it happens. Is there actually. a contract on that griffin? Nay, not at the moment. Used to be. As soon as a beast had built a nest nearby, the alderman would start a collection or go to the lord for help. Now the alderman don't use the privy without asking the black one's permission first. And... Seems they hanged the Lord. Well, we have to go ask so no contract. Stuff. Shame. We might have done something, but not for free. Well, anyway. Oh, what you have. Show me what you got behind the counter. What do you have? Why you has... Oh, yeah, we don't have any trophies. Oof. Because, you know, we can carry over everything from the previous time, but you can't carry your trophies because... It makes sense. Why would you carry over the trophies when, you know, you're going to have to make the trophies back anyway. I mean, recollect them and all that. Of course, we should have all the oils and, oof. Quest items. That sort of sucks, though, because 
some of the crest items were masks and stuff. Like, we probably don't even have our, you know, our Santa hat because... Well, uh, I think that was a crest item. Do I have my picture? I do have my picture. At least I kept my, that painting. Wait, does that mean I kept my offer stuff or no? Shit, does that mean I kept that? No, I kept my original figure. That's good. That's good. And my gold stick of joy. Spoon. Did I keep that with trophies? Spoon. I'm not sure if I that with trophies. Oh well. Herp. Okay. Here's the thing. We could re we could buy another one of those. Thing is, it's not gonna be better than it already is. Here's where things are gonna get complicated. Went. I mean, so far everything seems right. I mean, the cards seem like they should be the right cards, which makes me question things. Also, I have stacks of alcohol. I don't need to buy it. But you know. I, I still buy it because whatever reason. Like this food items. We don't need to buy them, but you know. Why not? I mean look how much alcohol we have though, just stacks of it. Kinda goes up to eighteen in most of those. Of course the ones that are fifty don't really matter to us because we need stuff that heals eighty. But we'll get, we might get that one perk which lets us constantly heal from food for like train man or so. Maybe. Possibly. We'll see. Anyway. Looking for a woman. Raven haired, violet eyes, dresses in black and white, riding in from Willoughby. And, uh, strange as it sounds, lilac and gooseberries might have smelled that. I've not seen nor smelt such a lady. I believe I'd remember. Yeah, especially hard to forget this one. Plenty of travelers about, though. Folk from all over. Might be worth your while to ask after her. Anyway. Thanks. For everything. That up. Please, I'm not decrepit yet. Then I'll ask about Yennefer. Mm hmm. Just remember, we'd rather not it draw any happen. attention. We'd rather not draw attention. Yeah. Here. Black one's been out measuring that. the fields. So talking Let to you. Measure. Better that than burning the harvest. Oh. Drommel. Drommel, you're dumber than a headless cockerel. Down there, so gone. There already. are four factions. I guess I'm already weighing outside. Yeah, they're already weighing outside. We haven't even done anything to aggro them. Oh my god, god. I'm looking for someone. And we seek some peace and quiet. Out of my face, freak. For your breath sours my beer. Bam! Red woman dressed in black and white. Seen her? Talk? Folks say the lady rode through the village a few days back. Galloping so fast she knocked Radabor into a ditch. Which way did she go? Dunno. Lots of tracks leading off the main road. Could have gone anywhere. Oi, people! The freak's taken Micah's mind! Uh-huh. And I'll take your tongue if you don't shut up. I said I wasn't going to start anything yet. Here I go. Chris, let's face it. The fight is technically still just outside. Like, we did nothing to aggro them, by the way. <laughs> They're just out there pissed off at us for no reason. It's fun. Eh, <sighs> anyway. Stash. So I should have, what, extra sets of my stuff? Gunmaster Wolfen, Manticore, Gunmaster Urzine, 
Feline, Viper, Warrior's Leather Jacket, which is apparently over my level. Viper. Yeah. Like, I would wear the Sir Garrett of Rivia saddle. Oh, I probably see don't get that face mask that matches it for. For your horse, so it's like, why would I? Hup. Ah, yes, and you guys. What a waste to learn of time! The earth shall revolve around the sun before you comprehend these rules. So remember, we're using the Grindry Dad. Got a minute? So this is going to be complicated and why bullshit. Not? Aldert Git, assistant professor in contemporary history at Oxenfurt Academy. Geralt of Rivia. Witcher, with tenure. I'm looking for a woman. Long hair, dressed in black and white. Seen anyone like that? Of course not! Unlike the populace, I know the horsewoman of war is pure poppycock. Horsewoman of war? What's that about? Folks say an omen. A beautiful phantom rides the fields at night, looks as you described her, armies follow her, and all who cross her path meet with misfortune. I can vouch for the last bit. Know where they saw her? No facts interest me, not fairy tales. Well, then you're useless to me. But anyway. Not a place I'd ever expect to find a scholar. Take it you're fleeing the war? Quite the opposite. Chasing it. I'm headed for the front. Tired of life? I seek knowledge, which I value more than life itself. I've a thirst no dusty old tomes can quench. I wish to see the Nilfgaardian invasion with my own eyes, understand it, and record it all in my chronicle, my magnum opus. Interesting. We need somebody to describe war, what it's really like. Not colorful banners and generals making moving speeches, but rape, violence, and thoughtless cruelty. Ah, I see you lack the polish of the Academy. Rape and cruelty are details of no import to the war's course. Trinkets on the garment of conflict, one might say. Hmm. <laughs> Tell that to the people whose houses burned down. Exactly. War reached Novigrad yet? Nope. But it's only a matter of time. Nilfgaard on one bank, Redania on the other. Drooling over the city like dogs over a juicy bone. Many a ruler's Redania's choked on that bone. There. True. We value our liberty in Novigrad, and we know how to fight for it. Uh -huh. The scholars especially. The sword is not the only weapon. Do not forget, architects from our academy designed the city walls. Walls no war machine has ever crumbled. Hmm. Gotta go. So long. A moment, Witcher. You strike me as a man of the world. Are you familiar with Gwent? No, and I don't have time to learn. But the rules are quite simple. Come, let's play. Yep. Hmm. Why not? Time to begin. Splendid! Here's how it's done. Welcome to Gwent. Well, let's see, I want to add that card. Then we reduce the let or fat defense of them, didn't they? Eh, ah, okay, uh, shit. Add the card when I tell you to add the card. The only problem though is I should actually pay more attention because, you know, these things could be different. Okay, let's actually look at cards. There we go. Okay, so decoy still does what decoy does. It swaps a unit out. Buying for us reduces strength for specific units on the battlefield to one. That's close combat units. Good. That's range units. Good. 
Okay. Change the units. Good. Clever ever removes all harsh effects. Good. Problem though is, if I don't need. That many of those. Okay, so let's go. They're just seven, seven, Trevor. Ooh, we have a Trevor Shay. Which summons our Trevor Shays. We have a Kara. Which instantly summons. Uh, I think it means it summons like. I think it means if we play Kara, it's going to summon. So they. And Sabrina. Death mode is just now. Catapult is a catapult. Wait, I think catapults used to be like at 8 and they would summon other catapults. I guess the trebuchet is now 8 and replace the catapult. That's also fast. Who, I think, it means she, yeah, she's linked to blue stripes. Commanders. Yeah, like it says here, some. Exactly. So those three are linked together. Okay then. So she's a four, but yet the blue stripes are now two instead of three. Constantness is no longer a spy card, apparently. And the shiny. Who instantly revives things? Here's the thing, Garfin used to be a two and Pretty much wanted to use this card, but now he's a three and he apparently he multiplies if he played with Sheridan Skaggs. And Zotin. I don't think we have Zotin yet. A bliss a ballista. Ballista? Ballista, yeah. Anyway, transforms into an over you when affected by regrowth. I guess regrowth. And, you know, the late for Bower Dragon Hunters. Witch Hunter can be either close or ranged. Siege Expert, Rico. Okay, so that's what they do. So they're no longer just, you know, plus one. So now, well, wait. Huh. Oh, that's not bad. Interesting. And then the Blue Stars Commando. Oh, and our good friends, the poor. No, I, I need to get rid of the poor infantry. I mean, yes, I know it's one, but no, no. Just like you, I don't need you guys. The only one point, and it makes me sad that you even exist. <laughs> like, I'll keep them because, well, my parts are not really that useful at this moment. Then Medic should do what Medic does. Okay, well, let's see how well this goes. Oh, I forgot to change my card, didn't I? Shit. Okay, so we have Impenetrable Fog, Clear Weather, Round 2, Regrowth. I promise I have Regrowth, but I don't have the things that it actually would trigger. I'll probably replace you. Problems I don't really need you. But where? Do I have any blue stripes? No. Oh shit, now I have the one that could be affected by regrowth. Son of a bitch. Ah, uh, well. Okay, so, first things first. Where do I start? Strong. Let's toss both all three of them in. I didn't need all of them in my. He starts with a ten. <laughs> he starts with a ten. Remember, you could turn off that old archers part, but we played archers, so. Hey, look, there's a spy card, which I had to. Oh, so it applies a negative fly, so it takes five away from mine. Cute. I don't like it. Not sure what to play now. 
Like, I could pass, but he could play something bullshit, so... Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to pass, and hopefully he passes too. Or he's going to... Three cards left, right? Problems. I only have one natural effect. Never mind. Oh, maybe only has environmental cards. Wouldn't that be great? Might be able to win if he does that. Oh no, he applied torrential rain. My siege unit. Okay, yay. So the question is, what is that we just his card do? Pick a torrential rain. So just basically, yeah, you play torrential rain. Well, no, actually, it's different. Because what it says it's basically a pixel card from your deck. It doesn't just play it. It just picks it from your deck. What do I? Oh. So basically, fog. Okay. Eh, yeah, it makes sense. Oh well. So not too bad yet. Figure did play me a bit for the first one, but then again, so that's because I played all three. I played three cards when I should have only played one because I should have swapped them out. Ah yeah, well. Well. You've a knack for this game. If you ever find yourself in Oxenfurt and wish to play a true master, ask for Stepan. A simple innkeep by trade, but a true maestro when it comes to wet. Hey, I'll remember that. Thanks. I didn't even try to see if my button still works for instantly winning, Grant. Look, hey, someone just left Grant cards on the floor. Why can't we take them? I mean, look at them. We need grant cards. Why can't we take them? And yes, I know we got Sultan and something out. Probably the book. But still, why can't we take those grant cards? Oh. If we play again, do I get anything? Let's new? play this. Okay, well, I have Sultan. Which go well. Wow. The Orton's not score or tell. Hmm. Surprise, surprise, I figured he would be. But on that side. But oh well, I guess since they made him in with those Northern Realms ones, Yarpin and Sheldon, I guess it makes sense. Oh so the leader. Change it. Calamba has is the one that has my siege ability now. Hmm. I wonder if it still works. Hands out. Destroy siege. If the combined is a ten or more. Destroys range. Dead. Place fog. Removes all active hostile environmental events. Eh. 
But honestly, that's that's probably the best, because it can actually help or hurt you, depending. Still. Anyway, let's see, does this still work? An interesting it round. still works. <laughs> if you desire a rematch, uh, let right. me know. So even though we have this mm, even harder grant, we can still just cheat. Lovely. Anyway, hey, Gaunter. Looking for a woman. Here to talk to you about me. Uh, like everyone. Not like everyone. And not just any woman. Mine smells of lilac and gooseberries, dresses in black and white. Two schnapsies. <laughs> It'll lift your spirits. Fine, I'll have a drink. Can we cut to the chase? You seen her or not? Yennefer of Wengerberg. Never mentioned her name. Yet you described her perfectly. And once I hear something, I never forget. Can't help it. How do you know Yennefer? What a question. Master Dandelion's ballads, of course. The only way a humble merchant might hope to rub up against greatness. Unless, that is, he's as lucky as I am. Right. And runs into a very patient witcher. It's a Geralt of Rivia himself. The Butcher of Blaviken. Recognize me from Master Dandelion's ballads, too? To your health. D that. Okay, then. And who might you be, Gondro? What do you do? Who are you? A mangy vagrant. Gaunt to Rodim, at your service. Vagrant? That a profession now? Ah, once a merchant of mirrors. The madding crowd dubbed me Master Mirror, or the Man of Glass. Uh -huh. You seen Yennefer? Deepest apologies, but I must ask. Is this about love? Guessed it. It's love. I knew it at once. Mercy. What do you know? Tell me. Before you appeared, it never occurred to me that might have been Yennefer. Who would have thought? Get to the point. An elf guardian scout from the local garrison saw her. Where? At their camp. She rode in there. Dark of night. Black and white. Gooseberries and... Yes, I know. Had a terse exchange with the garrison commander and raced off. Where to? <laughs> I'm not omniscient. Ask at the garrison. No, oh, yeah, I'm sure you know where she Thanks. is. Thanks. We you, men of the road must Dark stick Garden. together. Perhaps one day I'll be in trouble and you'll be nearby to help. Man, of course he's just gone. Just like that. Anyway. Time for this one. If they're just out here ready to fight me. Dundra mm -hmm. Then fuck off! <laughs> Don't want your kind here. No, oh, yeah, you don't want my kind here. How about some drowners, or, you know... How about the griffin comes and eats you? <laughs> then... Would you want my kind here? But anyway, here's the thing. Wouldn't want to stay long anyway. Maybe not. And maybe you'll just stay forever. Yeah. Six feet under. You just... Just answer the door. And they got wrecked because they got my food. Pathetic. Take it to me again. Nice meeting you. <sighs> Peasants. Horses freaking out. Goose, 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 goose. Goose, 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 goose. <laughs> We're catching snails. 
Yeah, we meet again. Thank you for saving me. Hi, Bran. People say all kinds of things about witches, but I've always known yours to be an honorable guild. So you managed to salvage some goods? Yes, but I await the repair of my wagon. As time passes, my losses grow. Do you need something? I I'll let it go half free. Half free. Let me have a look at your stock. So here's the thing. He says, Dr. Marengale, four, at least three more levels than we have. There's also stuff that we... could use if, if we wanted. I will buy that monocle, though. And maybe I will, though. Oh, that was our quest, so I'm sure, yeah, I'm going to buy those. By the Jamarian things, but no, they're not that great. A decoy and a catapult, though. I will buy a decoy and a catapult. And am I good on those? Hmm. Not enough coin, you say? It only cost train. Game, I think you lied to me, but I'll let it pass since I already have them. Take care. Okay. By the way, we have a Witcher Silver Sword. I forgot about that. I'm gonna go toss it inside the... Inside the stash, before I forget. Because we don't really need it. Because of obvious reasons. We also have a... Kill more armor. Hunting boots. Because, you know, the game's like, hey... Well, you need the starring armor, don't you? But no, no, I don't need the starring armor. God, starting items. You know what? Kill. That's not terrible, but anyway. Herp. Okay. Trails fresh. Oh God, yeah. What? We'll <laughs> it's like it's saying right to the end. We'll deal with that next time. So we start. We got now. Does it seriously lead really straight? A night race. A night race. Let's see. Are you a night race? Nope, the night rake went right, right on through the building. Did the game just crash? When I'm ending the video? Anyone want to go and jump in puddles? Wow, that's something. Anyway, I guess then, um, yeah, next time. Hope you all enjoy. Thank you all and have a nice day. Apparently, the game decided to lock up, right, as we were gonna go after that night. Potentially. At least we ended it. There you go. But still. Right there. Ah, fun times. Fun. Times. Anyway, next time.